so, could bait <laughs> the flash kick and then do it. That's what the EX uh, Tiger Knee was. I this baited out a flash kick, and then I did uh, Sagat's forward throw to punish because it's the sickest stuff. You know what's funny? His his light Tiger Knee is yes. like insanely good for that because it, it goes nowhere. It's like a really good. But also, like, you can't like uh, focus attack Sagat on like wake up because he can just Tiger Knee and break oh, it all. Yeah. Like Sagat does not fear focus attack. Focus attack on wake up anyway. You can. You have to space to correct it. Like I was doing it to last season. Like I spaced it just like slightly far back so that mine would reach. But if he did a flash kick, it would win. Oh really? Okay. Yeah. They're spacing for it. Some people have better plus like like if they have a really far reaching one, that's a good one. Yeah. I think Jury had a pretty far one, if I recall. Sagat's is not super far. <laughs> Cosmic Elegy. Oh my, this is the cross deck and stage. Yeah. <laughs> so I, I wasn't paying attention. I assume this is Guile versus Ken. Yeah. Did you know they're brother in laws? I've mentioned this many times when we've commentated together. That's it's true. finally irrelevant. Wow. Yeah. Okay, this is a button check. Button boy. But they're not allowed to switch characters because I've said so. Okay, first he has to make sure if he can put on his sunglasses. You can't do that in this game. Yeah, you can. No, they declared it illegal. Oh. That's a Herbert and Ernie exclusive. Oh. I might have messed with the formatting. I'll leave it. Just undo. Command Z. Oh, it's Command Z, right? Nothing happened. I'll leave it. Alas. So this is just a button check. It appears their buttons work. So when I think about Ultra Street Fighter 4 is they took out Vanilla Street Fighter 4's terrible tap to set for buttons, which was a thing in the early or late 2000s when they were making fighting games. Uh, they would have scroll to set. So you would go to the button and you could scroll through every single possible button you could set there oh, instead of tap to set. Absolutely. This is actual game one, ladies and gentlemen. That's, that's absurd. I don't know what I'm surprised people would even think of doing that. It's just, it's probably you weren't thinking design, about it. To be fair, but the tap to set both doubles as a button check and also works. Yeah. You know right away your button's not working. All right, let's go. Mission start. Oh yeah, now it's a party. Come on. I'm ready for you, meatball. All right, so I'm gonna say round start fireball. I was right. He didn't do sweep though. He didn't do the full scrub club. Oh, he did a, He did an actual combo on the um, uh, flow chart side. I haven't seen a single DP though, so he's really letting the flow chart down. There's a whole lot of jumping though. I'm impressed the guy is willing to jump this much against the Ken. <laughs> the I, I bet he doesn't. <laughs> He doesn't believe Ken Flowchart TV can DP on command. <laughs> That's my theory. I mean, he it's, hasn't really so far. It's, he did it once, but he got immediately hit by a fireball. Oh, he did okay, the DP, go. but he got the weakest hit of it. him with it. <laughs> Mega Zangief just drifting off into space in the background. <laughs> Guile remembers EX Fireball, beats regular Fireball. Now Guile's trying to reprogram that. All bad Guiles don't know how to approach. It's, it's the rule of, if you ever play a Guile, just try and make them, like, wake you out. It's so hard. It would have worked. It wouldn't have won, but it would have worked. It would have worked in When you play the game of EX Wake Ups, you either win or you get hit. That's true. I don't know if you can beat Guile, though. That was, that was a pro. He didn't get punished. Oh, my God. Sick. Herbert and Ernie's the legend. The truest of... Ken Flowchart TV did a jump in, it hit the wrong jump in button, so it whipped entirely on his crouching opponent. This is legendary. Oh, he tried to cancel. I don't think on any other stream you guys will find Ultra Street Fighter 4 players where they, they mess up the true combo of jump into sweep. Okay, he did he did a button into DP. I'm proud. Focus tech. He confirmed. He confirmed a, 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 a DP a flash and punish. Yeah. <laughs> What's his thing? The guy who plays Ken in every stream. A lot of people. No, but like literally only plays. Chris Ken. T? No, he's been no. switched. The... I, I can't remember. The has begun. There's been no relevant Ken's at 305, so I forget them. Yeah. <laughs> Chris T played him recently. He did. And he did a ditto. But... I was gonna say that's a him. Look. If, it, if this 
Guile really wants to impress He's gonna do Command Knee forward four times and then Splash Kick. I recall playing with him and Tim, and Tim told him how to do that. How to use whatever is it like medium kick? It's it's, it's hold back on um, light kick or heavy kick. Oh, or hold forward and head back on um, okay. light kick and heavy kick. Yeah. He taught him how to do it. He yeah, it's not hard. Not That's hard. the point of it. It lets Guy move forward while keeping charge. All that move ever be for. I don't know why you flash kick there. He was like 10 feet away. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe he meant to. No, you didn't mention fireball. the wrong button entirely. Nah, if you're charging, you meant to do it. <laughs> Alright, so we have Ken Flotar TV on round point here. But, it happened to me. He might choke really hard. I have. In Street Fighter 4, you can do that. Oh, uh, it looks like Ken Flotar TV. Well, I'm not very good at the flowchart process. Big punish, good punish. Yeah. <laughs> I saw he doesn't he doesn't he didn't even do like heavy kick heavy punch flash kick. Just flash kick. Look, when all you have is a hammer, you flash kick everything. I like how he was stand blocking, but then when Joe jumped at it, he crouch block. <laughs> so we have a rage quit on street nut. That was a rage quit from Joe's side. I think Herbert Ernie wins the game by default. Drop around. <laughs> he can still do it. You just need to hit one button. Oh. You lost the round. Go to game three. No, you lost, Joe, because your controller disconnected. <laughs> 